TCP/IP stack. The TCP/IP stack is a type of protocol stack. A protocol stack is a stack of protocol layers. Each layer handles a different process. The layers in a TCP/IP stack are the application layer, the transport layer, the network layer, the link layer. The application layer controls the applications, such as a web browser. The web browser sends a request to the internet. This request goes from the application layer to the transport layer. The transport layer uses the Transmission Control Protocol, or TCP for short. It uses this to split the data for the request into chunks that go into the packets. Because a computer may have many applications using the internet at the same time, TCP allocates each program a temporary client port within the range of 1024 and 4095. For example, the port for a web browser might be 1234. Any packets being sent by the web browser are received on port 1234. The combination of the IP address and the port form a socket. Any information sent to the web browser is sent to this socket. The information of the source and destination port is then added to the packet. The source port is 1234 and the destination port is port 80. Port 80 is used as if it is a registered universal port that is always used for HTTP. The packets are then passed to the network layer. The network layer gives the packets destination and source IP addresses. Then the packets are passed to the link layer. The link layer then adds hardware addresses. These addresses are MAC addresses. Two MAC addresses are added. These are the source and destination addresses. The packets are then sent to a gateway that attaches to the internet backbone. The packets are then routed along the internet backbone to the right IP address. When they get to the IP address, the process starts in reverse as the packets pass through the gateway on the other side to the link layer, to the network layer, which removes the IP source and destination, and passes the packets to the transport layer. The transport layer then reassembles the packets into data and passes them to the intended application on the application layer, which is in this case a web server on port 80. The web server receives the requests that our computer sent and sends back information the way it came until it gets back to our user and his web browser. <laughs>